At Prequel, we love skin protectants, and I am so excited to launch another product into our skin protectant platform, the Skin Utility Balm. At this point, you know about the Prequel Skin Utility Ointment and the Skin Utility Gel, and now we have the Skin Utility Balm, which in my mind sits in between those two. And the whole reason for that is not that I expect everyone to use all three of these skin protectants at the same time or in the same routine, but really to acknowledge the fact that everyone's skin is different and needs something a little bit different from their skin protectant. Each of Prequel's skin protectant products has a unique active ingredient that gives it its own special properties, and the Skin Utility Balm uses dimethicone. As a dermatologist, I love dimethicone. I look for it in products that I use and products I recommend to my patients, but I feel like this ingredient is somewhat misunderstood. I think of dimethicone as a really special ingredient. Not only does it enhance the texture of products, but it helps create this very smooth, breathable, flexible film on the skin that not only helps hydrate the skin, but also helps it recover. Where I think some people get intimidated about using dimethicone is they think it is pore clogging or comedogenic, but I actually find that dimethicone in products can be great for people with acne prone skin. This skin utility balm is formulated with 5.25% dimethicone. And at that concentration, dimethicone is really special. It acts as a great occlusive to help keep water in the skin and help keep aggressors like pathogens and other irritants out of the skin, but is still able to be breathable and comfortable. More simply put, a skin protectant serves to protect the skin. It keeps the bad stuff out and the good stuff in. And I know everyone's looking for something a little bit different in their protectant, but what I love about the Skin Utility Balm is that the skin feels shielded, but not suffocated. And I feel like as the brand founder, I really shouldn't be picking favorites here, but of the skin protectants that Prequel has, the Utility Balm is my favorite. As some of you know, I have rosacea. My skin tends to be a bit more sensitive and a little bit more on the dry side. So I'm always looking for a moisturizer that has a little bit of an extra or special quality. I find that this is the one I personally am reaching for the most in both my morning and evening routine when my skin needs a little extra something. I'm obsessed with this balm because even though we call it a balm, it's not heavy or pasty or greasy. When I take it out of the tube, it has this like, dense but whipped texture. And then when you go to rub it in, it's effortless, which is super important to me. I find that a lot of balms, you have to really work into the skin. And to me, that almost defeats the purpose because you're causing irritation with that added friction. So I really wanted a product that felt rich and luxurious and comforting on the skin, but was also easy to apply. So I don't think this is just a product for people with dry skin. If you have combination skin or you have sensitive skin, this balm is going to be great. I think one of the things I love about it the most is how it dries down and absorbs into the skin. It doesn't have any greasiness to it. It's not shiny at all. It really has what I would consider like a natural finish to it, which I think is really important because I think a lot of us want something that's going to really nourish, comfort, envelop the skin, but we don't want to see it on our skin or look shiny or greasy. I find myself reaching for this a lot in the evening to use over the top of the rest of my skincare, but if someone has more sensitive skin or dehydrated skin and they're looking for more nourishment to their skin during the day, this does layer well under things like sunscreen. And because this is moisturizing, but not greasy or heavy, this makes for a fantastic makeup primer as well. So if you're looking for something to prep your canvas, I think this is a great option. In addition to this balm having dimethicone, which protects the skin barrier and provides that long lasting comfort, this also has a unique lipid complex comprised of fatty acids, ceramides, and cholesterol that mimic the skin's natural lipids. I really like having that complex in here because it helps maintain the skin's moisture balance and helps the skin look and feel its best. This also contains shea butter, which has a unique fatty acid profile that gives it special moisturizing properties. And lastly, because this balm is absolutely stacked, it also has Centella Asiatica as well as aloe and chamomile to soothe, calm, and comfort the skin. Like I mentioned earlier in the video, the Skin Utility Balm really sits in between the Utility Gel and the Utility Ointment for me. It's kind of like the Goldilocks formula in my opinion. So there are people who are going to love that gel because maybe they have more oily skin or they're looking for a really lightweight skin protectant. And there are gonna be certain times that I reach for that more than I reach for the balm. For example, in the summer or when I'm traveling to more humid climates. I also love the ointment. It serves a huge purpose in my routine. I use it on my lips and cuticles multiple times a day. But I think in terms of what's going on my skin the most, it's the Skin Utility Balm as my nightly moisturizer and kind of what I use to slug over the top of anything else. The Utility Balm also contains something called a lipophilic skin hydrator, which is going to help maintain the water balance in the skin and give long lasting relief. The way I use the Skin Utility Balm in my routine is kind of twofold. So one, post-procedurally, 
As a dermatologist, I kind of feel like I gotta walk the walk. So I'm constantly doing light laser resurfacing things like Clear and Brilliant or microneedling, and I really like to use this particular balm to help me recover from those treatments. The other way this has made it into my regular routine is as a nighttime moisturizer. Especially since it's been cooler and drier outside, this balm really does comfort the skin in the evening, and I like to use it as the last step in my skincare. I even featured this on my Instagram stories like a month ago. I kind of teased it, and I think you guys could tell it was a pre product and I got so many messages being like, I need that, like when is that launching? It's launching, it's this. This is truly a utility balm, so even though I've been sort of discussing it for use on the face, you can use it anywhere on the body. I really like it for elbows and knees, it's great for eyelids. So anywhere on your body where you feel like your skin just needs a little more help, I think the Skin Utility Balm is perfect. You guys know I'm a huge fan of the prequel Skin Utility ointment, but anytime I kind of want to reach for that, but then I'm also like, mm, I gotta put pants on right after, I have to go about my day, I use the balm instead because it's a little bit better for just like day-to-day -day things, and then the ointment is what I'm using to occlude things at night. The prequel Skin Utility Balm is fragrance-free, hypoallergenic, allergy-tested, and definitely safe for eczema-prone skin. The Skin Utility Balm is now available on our website, prequelskin.com. I'm so excited for you to get this on your face and on your body. If you use it, please give me all your feedback. I wanna know how much you're loving it. And of course, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to me or reach out to us at Prequel Skin.